My name is Bob Wilt. I'm the CEO of the Saudi Arabia mining company, Modin. We are a global leader in phosphate fertilizers, so we mine phosphate from several different mines around the kingdom and we export it to about 50 countries globally. We mine bauxite and convert it into aluminum. We've got a diversified portfolio, all in the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. So we've got a huge exploration program to determine what is actually here in the kingdom. And we'll continue to develop that, and that's part of our 10x growth strategy in the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. But as you can see outside, the kingdom is you know, transforming so quickly. There's so many cranes on the skyline. There's so many automotive plants springing up and other industries springing up. The kingdom can't wait for our exploration program to yield results. So we have established a fund with the PIF to go out and source strategic minerals that the kingdom needs for its downstream diversification efforts in the near term. So we're focusing on iron ore to develop the steel industry here in Saudi Arabia copper, lithium, nickel for EV batteries and automotive sector. So as the kingdom diversifies its economy, it's our job to provide the minerals for it and the metals for it, whether it's sourced from our own efforts here in the kingdom or what we do with our fund with the PIF externally. Your vision is to be a sustainable mining champion with global presence. Yes. That's quite a vision. How are you going to achieve that? So we've got a global presence already, but to make it sustainable, that's what we take very seriously. Um, we want to do it in a different manner than miners in the past have done it. So we've made a pledge to be carbon neutral by 2050, and we're well on the path to that. But there's so much more to being an ESG sustainable champion than carbon neutrality. We've got a significant mandate to develop a mining ecosystem in Saudi Arabia. So that means establishing a local supply chain to develop the mining sector. It's about 50% of everything we buy is locally sourced and we want to increase that to 65, 70% in the next couple of years to develop a, a supply chain here in Saudi. And we want to develop Saudi youth to go into the mining sector. So we are very serious about developing education systems and opportunities. 